Hello and welcome. In this video, I'm going to introduce to you how the functions and fields of the BEAS Item Master window have been integrated into the SAP Item Master and demonstrate how you can set this as default and use it. With this option now, you can access and manage your own BEAS user fields and WMS data in one place. As of BEAS 2020.11 beta version, you can access the BEAS Item Master data with all BEAS functionalities directly from the SAP Item Master with a basic BEAS license. For this, we have added new settings in the configuration wizard. The display of the Item Master window can now be the following. Setting, non-integration, no integration is activated and you can open the manage Item Master data as in the previous BEAS versions. BEAS window. With this setting, SAP integration is active but you can view and manage item master data in the separate BEAS window with all functions gathered in its various tabs. When you open the item master from a BEAS form, the system opens the BEAS item master data window. SAP window. With this default setting, you can view and manage item master data in the SAP Business One item master window with the integrated BEAS functions. When you open the item master from a BEAS form, the system opens the SAP item master data window. Let's see what it looks like with the BEAS functions inside. When the SAP window setting in the configuration wizard is active, the SAP item master window includes a separate tab for the BEAS functions. The name of the tab is Advanced Production. This tab includes core BEAS fields grouped in areas, General, Inventory, Scheduling, Manufacturing Data, and Calculation, Item Version, Batches, Serials, if applicable. The fields here are accessible depending on the type of the item and if the function is active for the item. Please note that the visibility of procurement method by production lot size and calculation also depends on certain settings. By choice, these related fields can be moved to any desired place in the item master window with the help of edit form UI function. The tables of the collected functions are available in certain drop-down menus and you can access editing windows by clicking the yellow arrow left of the fields. Further BEAS functions are available in the right-click menu. With the advanced item creation and the advanced item duplicate, the system opens the function to create or copy new items. All functions that appear as separate tabs in the old BEAS item master window are collected in the extended production submenu. Please note that you can only see most of these functions if they were activated in the relevant settings of the configuration wizard. The Invent History opens the BEAS Inventory History for the item with all tabs that are relevant for the item. The Used In menu entry opens the Used In BEAS window of the previous versions but with two tabs, one for usage of Bill of Materials and one for Documents. The Bill of Materials menu entry opens the BEAS BOM editing function for the item. The Routing menu entry opens the definition of routing positions for the item. You can access the Structure Report and the Structure View. With the Extended Description, you can provide additional description for the item. You can access this in the Remarks tab of the Old Bears Item Master window. In the SAP Integrated Extended Description, you can also add two more images to the one uploaded in the Remarks tab. The Quality Control option opens the window to store and manage QC inspection plans for the item. The Parameter menu option gives you a chance to add further details to the item with user-defined parameters. The Product Configurator option is visible when the Product Configurator module is available for the user. With the Variant menu option, you can store variants for the item. And with the Variant script, you can change properties of field positions using the script. Please remember that you can access the SAP Item Master data with BEAS integrated Item Master functions with a basic license and by setting it up in the configuration wizard. For more information, please see our documentation. Thank you for your attention and please reach out to us concerning any questions you might have.